Yeah, my name is uh, Prem Parivartan, popularly known as Papal Baba, and I represent a mass movement called Give Me Trees Trust. Uh, so before we start the interview, I'd request, I would request you to keep the answer slightly short and brief. Uh, so my first question is that what sustainability means to you? Because we are uh, trying to start a mission on sustainability. So what, do, what does that mean to you? For me, sustainability means health and happiness. So I think we uh, get too often caught up in uh, vocabularies and terminologies and uh, uh, these days technologies and patents and PowerPoint presentations and all. And we are always talking about 2050 and 2070, not realizing that most of us will not be here. So for me, sustainability means uh, uh, being a person who has worked in the area of afforestation uh, for the past 46 years. It's very simple that we have to sustain for the next seven years now because the next seven years is going to decide whether the human race, the human uh, dominated history of the planet will sustain or not because the way AI is taking over algorithms and the way technology is coming in and uh, being a person, a field person, uh, when we come into the cities, when we meet people, educated people, when we see people talking technology, they are far, far, far from reality. They are far from reality. You know, they, they are just trying to console themselves that we have time till for the next 50 years, 100 years. Sorry, uh, I don't see it that way. You know, it's, it's so scary out there. So the moment you move out of the metropolitan areas and you go into the fields, you go into the... Uh, existing forest, the primary forest, and you go to the mountains, you go to the villages, you go to the countryside, that is where the reality is, and uh, it's nowhere what is being discussed in the cities. Nowhere, nowhere near uh, what is being discussed in the summits, nowhere near what is being discussed in climate conferences. Uh, the current scenario, if you see, uh, why do you think no action is not a solution, is not an option anymore? Absolutely, I think uh, this hashtag or this slogan, no action, it, it makes perfect sense because this is exactly what I've been saying for the last uh, four decades to people, you know, that action is the main thing, you know. We are so much into theory, 98% of the talk that we do is theory, you know, and it's, it's okay to have things on paper, but where is the action? You know, hardly 2% of the people are actually involved in action on the ground, in the field. That is where, you know, that is what is really required. You know, we, we are discussing a lot of things. Um, we are presenting a lot of things. We are obsessed with numbers. But, you know, uh, y you can talk about uh, good nutrition and, you know, vitamins and you can talk about whatever. But if there is no basic dal roti, so how will you do it? And it's so fundamental, you know. And, at the fundamental level, uh, the planet is suffering. And uh, the planet, uh, my fear is, the planet will just decide one day that I don't need this homo sapien race. Uh, every six minutes, ma'am, uh, we are losing one species. What makes you think that we are not the, not next in line? So when you are on the field, you, you realize these things. You know? We are in the middle of the, uh, the conflict, and uh, we are also talking about what initiative we should be taking. I think individual action, individual action. Because when you talk about action, action is not about government. Action is about individual. Uh, it has to be a citizen movement. And there are ways, there is hope. I'm not saying there is no hope. <sighs> because uh, governments can uh, give you policy. Uh, it's important. But the work is to do government to aake khade khodegi nahi aur wahan pe jangal lagayegi nahi government to aake wahan par nadiyon ko saaf nahi karegi government to aake so jo individual action hai i think we need to focus more on that in a very positive way and uh, i think no action and uh, i i think action is the only thing that we have that is the only hope we have